seeking the perfect motherboard to match the AMD Radeon RX 7900 XTX? The RX 7900 XTX is at the pinnacle of AMD's GPU offering, excelling in 4K gaming performance, and with its 24GB of GDDR6 VRAM, it's poised to maintain its cutting-edge status well into the future. In this video, I highlighted the finest AMD and Intel motherboards tailored for this elite GPU. We start with the most economical choice, proceed to the ultimate high-end board, and finish with the motherboard that delivers the greatest overall value. So let's start with the three best AMD boards first. Price information and all motherboards mentioned in the video are available in the description. Number 3. MSI Pro B650MA Best budget AMD motherboard to pair with Radeon RX 7900 XTX. The MSI Pro lineup of motherboards has proven to be a reliable choice for simple office or workstation PCs. With the introduction of the new Ryzen 7000 CPUs, MSI has made notable improvements to the VRMs, and this is apparent in the Pro B650MA. Still by current standards, the VRMs on this board are considered modest yet capable. It features a set of 8-phase VRMs that are effectively cooled by a thick heatsink. As a result, even under an all-core load with a stock 7950X, the VRMs only reach a maximum temperature of 78 degrees Celsius. Of course, I do not recommend anyone to get a 7950X for this motherboard, but this does go to show the premium quality even on a budget-friendly motherboard. Performance is an overall advantage of this board, and even the RAM support is excellent. Usually, MSI boards do not clock memory much higher than 6400 mega transfers per second, but this board does support up to 7200 mega transfers per second DDR5 RAM. If we take a look at the rear I.O., MSI has kitted the Pro B650MA with eight USB Type A ports, where four of them are running at USB 3.2 Gen 1 and four of them at USB 3.2 Gen 2 speeds. Sadly, there isn't a single USB Type-C port on the rear I.O. Also, MSI should have added at least two USB 2.0 Type-A ports because now you'll have to use two USB 3.2 Type-A ports for peripherals like a mouse and keyboard. Thankfully, the front I.O. has four USB 2.0 Type-A, one USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-C, and two USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type-A ports, which does alleviate some of my concerns. The rear I.O. also has a BIOS flashback button, which is fantastic for upgrading the BIOS without needing to install a compatible CPU. Other than that, everything else you get is pretty standard, like HDMI 2.1, DisplayPort 1.4, Wi-Fi 6E, Bluetooth 5.3, 2.5 gig LAN, and a standard 3-port array of audio jacks. When it comes to aesthetics, the MSI Pro lineup of motherboards has a simple all-black design. It's not for showing off your PC, but rather something with a tried and true formula and a look that won't clash with anything else. Being a micro ATX board, there aren't going to be as many PCIe slots as one would expect from a full-sized ATX board. The total, you get two M.2 SSD slots and three PCIe slots for expansion. The first PCIe slot is a proper X16 PCIe 4.0 slot that is connected directly to the CPU. The other two slots are just simple PCIe 3.0 times 1 and PCIe 4.0 times 4 slots. It would make sense to go with this board's bigger brother, the MSI Pro B650P Wi-Fi, if you really want an extra PCIe slot and a stronger VRM if you have a much bigger budget to spend on the motherboard. In terms of competition, the most interesting alternative is the AS Rock B650M Pro RS Wi-Fi, which is very similar to this motherboard in many ways. The reason why I prefer the MSI Pro B650MA Wi-Fi is that for just $10 more, you get a neater design, an extra PCIe slot, and much better USB ports. The AS Rock is a good choice if you're looking to squeeze as much of your budget as possible and really want a USB Type-C port on the back. But it is clear that the B650MA Wi-Fi is hard to pass, especially given how similarly priced they both are. In conclusion, the MSI Pro B650MA is going to be the ideal choice for budget Ryzen machines. Its solid VRM is what mainly makes it a worthy recommendation. It doesn't go overboard in any shape or form and just gets the job done.
All these make it ideal for a budget PC with the RX 7900 XTX. Number 2. Gigabyte X670E Aorus Master Best high-end AMD motherboard to pair with Radeon RX 7900 XTX. The Gigabyte X670E Aorus Master is an exceptional motherboard perfect for users seeking to unleash the full potential of their CPU and GPU. Its fantastic feature set, stunning design, and compatibility with the latest technology make it the best high-end motherboard for Radeon RX 7900 XTX, especially if you plan to overclock your CPU to the max and need top 4K gaming performance. With its astonishing 16 plus 2 plus 2 phase VRM design and advanced cooling solutions, such as Fins Array 3, Mega Heat Pipe, Thermal Pad, and dedicated heat sinks for each M2 slot, the Aorus Master ensures optimal power delivery and stability. In addition, these features contribute to impressive thermal performance during extreme overclocking sessions, satisfying the needs of performance enthusiasts. In terms of storage, it truly shines with its diverse and lightning-fast options. Boasting four M2 slots and six SATA ports, this motherboard accommodates various storage configurations, including two PCIe 5.0 times 4 M2 slots for cutting-edge storage technology. Furthermore, its support for up to 128GB of DDR5 memory and a maximum frequency of over 6600 MHz makes it a future-proof investment for users looking to stay ahead of the curve. Connectivity-wise, the board stands out with unmatched PCIe and USB support. It caters to every possible need, featuring three PCIe slots, including one PCIe 5.0 slot for superior graphics card performance and an extensive selection of USB ports. The Wi-Fi 6E and Bluetooth 5.3 support also add to the appeal of this high-end motherboard. These features cater to both gamers and content creators, making it a well-rounded option for users with varying needs. Not only is the X670E Aorus Master a powerhouse in terms of performance, but it also boasts a stunning design with a sleek black finish on the PCB and captivating RGB effects on the I.O. cover. It adds a touch of elegance to any build, making it a great choice for those who value aesthetics in addition to performance. Nevertheless, you should consider the form factor of the X670E Aorus Master as it is an EATX motherboard so you must ensure that you have a compatible PC case to accommodate the larger size of this motherboard. In conclusion, the Gigabyte X670E Aorus Master is a top-tier choice for performance enthusiasts and high-end users who prioritize power, cooling, and advanced features. Its impressive feature set and stunning design make it the best high-end motherboard for the RX 7900 XTX, especially if you plan to overclock your CPU. While it may come at a premium price, the performance and experience it offers make it a worthwhile investment for those who demand the best. Number 1. AS Rock X670E Steel Legend – Our Top Choice I'd say that AS Rock is pretty bold to call this motherboard a legend, but I don't think they are quite off on that, and that's why the AS Rock X670E Steel Legend is my top pick board to pair with the Radeon RX 7900 XTX. What makes this one of the best motherboards available in the market is that on top of having all the necessities, it also has an excellent VRM design, 16 plus 2 plus 1 phases at 60 amp. So running even the 7950X at high clocks won't be an issue. A rather rare feature of the Steel Legend is its two Ethernet ports, one being 1 gigabyte and the other 2 gigabyte. It also comes with an insane number of USB ports. I counted a total of 12 in the back, with support for 5 more in the front. Perhaps my favorite feature of this motherboard is the inclusion of a graphics card holder. This included holder is perfect for giant GPUs like the RX 7900 XTX, so that they won't sag. I wish more vendors included this nowadays. This is truly the best value seekers board. Reliable power delivery, sturdy board design, overloaded with features, and an excellent price to match. What more can one want? Also, unlike the Steel Legend, most boards in this price range don't offer Gen 5 support on the Time 16 slot. All in all, I needed a board that would yield the most value. Being a budget board does not mean that it just needs to be cheap and cut corners. 
At the end, I really wanted to recommend the Gigabyte X670 Gaming XAX as the top choice for the RX 7900 XDX. However, right now, the price of the Steel Legend is just $30 more than the Gaming X, and it overshadows the Gaming X in terms of features, and that makes it the ideal choice. Before moving to the Intel motherboards, it would really help us continue making more videos if you support us by just hitting the like button and subscribe, or even with a comment, so that we know if you like it or if there's something we can do to improve next time. I promise it costs nothing, just a few seconds. Now let's see which are the top three Intel motherboards. Number three, MSI Mag B760 Tomahawk Wi-Fi DDR4. Best budget Intel motherboard for the RX 7900 XTX. The MSI Meg B760 Tomahawk Wi Fi DDR4 is a budget friendly motherboard that doesn't compromise on performance or aesthetics, making it an excellent choice for the Radeon RX 7900 XTX. MSI has a knack for creating visually appearing motherboards, and this one is no exception. It's all black design, including the PCB and various heatsinks give it a sleek and sophisticated look that will complement any build style. Despite its budget-friendly positioning, the B760 Tomahawk is packed with features. It boasts a PCIe 5.0 slot, providing future-proofing for upcoming graphics cards. It also includes three Gen 4 M2 slots, offering up to 64GB per second for optimal read and write speeds. And it also features an integrated I.O. shield, reducing the hassle of installing a separate one. The rear I.O. is generous, including a USB 3.2 Gen 2 x 2 Type-C port, integrated Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, and 2.5 gigabit LAN. One of the standout features is MSI's Easy M2 Clip, which provides a toolless installation process for M2 SSDs. This simplifies the building process and eliminates the need for tiny screws. Despite its lower price point, the B760 Tomahawk comes with some handy accessories including a Wi-Fi antenna for the integrated Wi-Fi 6E and Bluetooth, an Easy M2 clip for easy SSD installation, and SATA cables for older storage mediums. The board supports 12th, 13th, and 14th gen CPUs, making it a versatile choice for budget, mid-range, or high-end systems. However, it's best suited for the Intel Core i3 and i5 processors due to its lack of overclocking support and lower PCIe lane count. So in a nutshell, if you're looking for an affordable motherboard that packs a punch in terms of features and looks, the MSI Meg B760 Tomahawk Wi-Fi DDR4 should be on your radar. For those building with the Radeon RX 7900 XTX and don't want to overspend, this one's a clear winner. Number 2. Gigabyte Z790 Aorus Master Best High-End Intel Motherboard for the RX 7900 XTX the Gigabyte Z790 Aorus Master offers a remarkable power delivery system and exceptional features that make it a powerhouse and ideal for premium builds with the Radeon RX 7900 XTX. While it has a high price tag, it's worth every penny for those who are looking for top-tier performance. One of the most impressive features of this motherboard is its VRM setup, which boasts a remarkable 23-phase architecture. Of these 23 faces, 20 are devoted to providing clean and reliable power to the CPU. Each phase provides 105 amps directly to the CPU, ensuring that even the i9-14900K can be overclocked with ease. Moreover, the VRM components are effectively cooled with multiple heatsinks, which means that temperatures won't ever be a problem, even when running an overclocked i9-14900K on a day-to-day -day basis. This makes the Z790 Aorus Master an excellent choice for gamers and enthusiasts who want to push their systems to the limit without having to worry about overheating issues. Apart from the potent power delivery system, the Z790 Aorus Master also offers an extensive feature set that caters to needs of gamers and creative professionals alike. This DDR5 model works seamlessly with the latest Intel processors and supports DDR5 memory up to 8,000 mega transfers per second. It also features four M2 slots, a host of high-speed USB ports, and support for up to six SATA drives for your storage devices. Networking is a standout feature of the board, as it includes a 10 gigabyte Ether LAN port for wired connections, as well as the Wi-Fi 6E standard for reliable wireless networking. 
The Marvell 10 Gigabyte Ether LAN is a great contributor to the board's overall capability and versatility, making it the perfect choice for enthusiasts and professionals. The absence of an HDMI output on the rear I.O. may be a minor inconvenience, but it's not a deal breaker, especially considering the other features that this motherboard has to offer. You can find the Asus ROG Strix Z790E at the same price point, but I prefer the Aorus Master due to its overclocking potential and superior networking features. In terms of appearance, the Z790 Aorus Master has a sleek and contemporary design with a simple layout attractive lighting, and a neutral color scheme. The RGB lighting is skillfully implemented, and the overall appearance of the board is quite modern and attractive. At the end of the day, Gigabyte Z790 Aorus Master is undoubtedly one of the very best high-end motherboards to pair with the Radeon RX 7900 XTX. So if you're looking for a top-tier motherboard that can deliver exceptional performance and reliability, the Z790 Aorus Master is the one to get. Number 1. Gigabyte Z790 Aorus Elite AX, our top choice. Our top choice, the Gigabyte Z790 Aorus Elite AX, is one of the strongest contenders for the best Z790 motherboards available in terms of offering value for money. It's an all-router that covers every aspect while being cost-efficient as Gigabyte manages to keep the cost down while still managing to offer competitive features for the consumer. In terms of looks, this board is a rather simplistically designed ATX form factor motherboard that features a large heatsink design with plenty of cooling on the VRMs. Much of the PCB is exposed, so such a design keeps its price towards the reasonable end. Gigabyte knows how to make great motherboards, as the Z690 variant of the same lineup was featured in our video for the best motherboards for the i9-12900K. It builds upon the foundations of the older variant and is a better choice for 13th and 14th gen CPUs due to the better VRM configuration. Its PCB is all black, while the heatsinks have a black and gray color combination, giving the board a sleek look. There are RGB elements towards the bottom of the board that can be customized to your liking using the Gigabyte RGB Fusion 2.0 software. The motherboard also features four DDR5-based DIMM slots with 128GB overclockable to 7600MHz. It sports a dual-channel memory architecture, and those looking to enable the maximum capacity of performance will want to use this board's high overclocking capability with the new XMP 3.0 memory module support. When it comes to PCIe slots, it has three of them. However, only the top PCIe slot wired to the CPU socket is a fully functional PCIe Gen 5 x 16 slot, which will open up your upgrade paths for the future. The remaining two are standard PCIe 4 slots with the ratings of x4 speed. Additionally, Gigabyte offers exclusive stainless steel PCIe shielding on this board. The new generation PCIe 5.0 armor is 20% wider to provide reinforced tensile strength. Its stainless steel pins have multiple points to penetrate the PCB and increase the durability of the SMD. The board features four Gen 4 M2 ports. The M2 Thermal Guard 3 installed here features a six times optimized heat dissipation surface and double sided M2 heat sinks to prevent bottlenecks and throttling. Easy Latch Plus is also present, which enhances the user experience with a quick release and screwless design of the M2 connectors. When it comes to connectivity features, it uses Wi-Fi 6E with a dedicated 6 GHz band. It enables lower latency and seamless connectivity, where you can enjoy up to 2.4 GB per second speeds. The 2.5 GB per second LAN chip makes it perfect for improved gaming experiences. It also features WiMA and Fine Gold audio capacitors, which allow the Z790 Aorus Elite AX to reproduce studio-grade quality. The QFlash Plus feature allows the user to upgrade the BIOS without installing the CPU, memory, or graphics card. This feature might not be so handy for now, but if you're planning to upgrade your rig down the line, you will be thankful. The rear I.O. has a fair share of options when it comes to high-speed USBs. The fastest USB port is a Type-C format USB 3.2 Gen 2 x 2, which rates up to 20 gigabytes per second. All in all, compared to its competitors, this is the best overall value motherboard right now to pair with the RX 7900 XTX due to its features, value, and performance.